so since you have been focusing a lot that you have to read so any youngster maybe who has not been all all are not lucky enough to join your office how do you suggest him that what should be the rough draft of a written uh, plaint or a writ petition to be drafted and then if you have to file a counter what steps he should he or she should keep in a mind while doing that first thing that a lawyer must do is sorry yes sir first thing a lawyer must do is try to find out the law which has a bearing on the problem if you know the law you are in a better position to draft out the petition or the plaint after all adverse position as all of you know if a person is in occupation of a property for 12 long years he can claim adverse possession against uh, ordinary individuals and if it is more than 30 years against the government one of the things that the law one i mean the law with regard to adverse possession is you can't claim both ownership as well as adverse possession the moment you if you do not know that you know this is the law you make a mistake when you draft out a plaint if you know the law beforehand you will draft out the plaint or the writ petition in a more precise and in a more legal framework that's why i said section 16 uh, uh, c or the uh, uh, specific relief act had i not known about it i would have drafted the uh, a plaint without ever or without pleading that i have always been ready my client has always plaintiff has always been ready and willing and continues to be ready and willing without that pleading the plaint is liable to be dismissed of course there is a change in the law now that ever meant you know is not needed but that is what it is try to understand the law then you are in a better position to draft out one second plain language simple sentences every paragraph must contain one idea don't make you know too lengthy a paragraph i have seen lawyers drafting out their paragraph will run into two pages three pages judges will not have the time and the patience to look into that kind of a pleading or a, 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 a draft make it short precise concise break it into shorter paragraphs each idea in one paragraph you are better off so this is how you learn interaction with the senior revision of the drafts that you make improve try and achieve excellence never be satisfied with what you have always you know go a step ahead you are sure i'm sure in fact let me tell you this i was going for karate classes long back we had to run for 5 miles after 2 miles we would feel as if you know we will fall down but if you cross that threshold we could run you know the entire not only 5 miles we could run 10 miles that is what it is never give up always you know strive hard and say that you are able to achieve the top you will achieve the top it is that ambition that innate belief in yourself that is very very important every person can reach the everest it's not that people you know today people who have lost one leg have gone to the everest you know there is one if you just got it get into the net you know you will find out i have already said that earlier also to you stephen hawkins one of the greatest thinkers that uh, the world had astrophysicist he was on a wheelchair he had a voice synthesizer he couldn't speak yet he wrote several books which were masterpieces so to the youngsters i would say have belief in yourself try to achieve excellence work hard have your hands clean never you know sully your hands ultimately one must be able to sleep well and if you cheat somebody you will not be able to sleep well so bear this in mind have ambition go to the top you are able to do it always you know focus the top focus at the top you will climb up the ladder without any hassle so according to you the mantra would be if you believe then you can conceive and if you can conceive then you can achieve correct absolutely you have put it very very succinctly that is what is precise and brevity is that is what is needed from a lawyer so the 
uh, they normally no, say you that are, as a lawyer. illustration which i did not i'm grateful to you and oh. i'm sure the youngsters are grateful to you oh. because they always say that there are only three uh, principles for being a successful profession one should be in size concise and precise 